The paintings began with this image of the view from above, but they also acknowledged the position of encountering this landscape from the ground. The making of the painting is also about seeing through the colour, as if seeing from underneath, looking upwards through a sort of transparent film of the lake. These three positions are kind of alternating perspectives which form the way the painting is made. There are about 75 mine water treatment sites that exist in the UK and they are treating the polluting mine water that's coming out of the old coal mines that no longer function. These coal mine water treatment sites, they started to be built around about 10 to 15 years after the coal mines shut down. Those began to fill with water and slowly that water crept up and got closer and closer to the surface, broke out into rivers and lakes. The sites themselves are hidden from view. They're, they're screened off and they're behind fences, um, but you can see them from above. And that was how they appeared to me first. What I did was I went round each of these sites, collected buckets and then took them back to the studio and then worked with the material here. Each of the sites became very clearly different, distinct from each other. There were certain specific things about where a place was located and how it sat in the ground and how it was encountered from the ground level. The pigment itself, it holds the character of the landscape. The, the pigment is there because of 200 years of coal mining. This is a residue of what we've been doing and what we're still doing. It's a complex material. It's considered a waste material, but it's also the oldest cultural material. Its roots go back to the beginning of the history of painting, the history of human ritual. Each site and each landscape it sits in is different and bears the distinct marks of that particular geography, the geology, that landscape history. The land is contained in the pigment and the pigment is an expression of the landscape. It now has an interesting place because it's showing us how destructive we're being. <laughs>